is a subtle change that I've seen as well, and I'm not sure if it's just because there's too many people playing or because there's less people actually queuing for multiplayer now, but it feels like it's taking longer to actually find and get into these games. Now, I'm not exactly sure if that's because Shoot House and Tier 1 aren't in quick play, and they're kind of like featured little playlists, like little buttons you click, but it's definitely kind of strange, man. I mean, I'm on PC playing right now. I have crossplay on. We have the entire matchmaking pool to choose. Yo, 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 what's going on, guys? And today, we're here to talk about Season 1. It, it fucking sucks. Like, honestly, dude, like, everything about this update sucks. Like, since this update, my game's been crashing more. My game's been freezing more. Because apparently, apparently PC players and next-gen players are dealing with this. But, dude, it's only Xbox One players, apparently. You see, look, it just stuttered. But basically... I don't even know what's going on. Like, Infinity Ward also button, uh, made the footsteps louder than 2019, apparently. And it, you know what? No, it's not apparently. It's true. Like, dude, Infinity Ward, why? Like, I don't get it. Why do you not want people rushing in your fucking game? Every time. Like, the last... Two boots on the ground games you had. Fuck Ghost and fucking Modern Warfare 2019. You fucking catered to campers. And now it's even worse in this game. Like, and the. <sighs> like, all, all this game does is cater to noobs. It is annoying. Why? You know, that's not even a big part, right? Hardcore's in the game. Well, it fucking sucks. You can't see your kill cam. You don't know if your guns are leveling up. You don't know if you're killing the guy because realism, like Infinity Ward, don't you get it? You're not Insurgency. You're not Irma. You're not fucking SOCOM. You're not Break Ghost Recon, Breakpoint, or Wildlands. Stop trying to be realistic. <sighs> the M13. You have to play DMZ. Now, I'm not saying... I, I, I like DMZ. Don't get me wrong. It's amazing. I had fun with it last night with friends. However, the fact that you have to play a fucking game mode to get a gun... It's just fucking stupid. And the fact that season one is is just content that could have been in the game from the beginning annoys me. Like, you have YouTubers like Exclusive Ace who aren't playing the game no more for, for on their free time. And what's crazy is that nobody cares at infinity ward they don't care about the rushers all they care about is fucking their sentinels <sighs> jesus christ and you want to know something this game was my last game before season one. I ended up go dropping 26 kills. Honestly, I love this game. I like playing it with people and parties. Playing this game playing this game solo is a nightmare. Oh, and another thing, the intro clip. Anytime I try and load a game with a party, it takes a billion years. Like, am I playing Modern Warfare 3 or Black Ops 2. Like, it shouldn't take me a million years. This game is new. I have crossplay on. You mean to tell me I can't find a lobby? Like, am I playing old an old Gen COD? Am I playing Black Ops 1? <sighs> oh my goodness gracious. Mmm. And the fact that they're doing this bullshit they did in Vanguard where, oh, we're releasing half of the weapons 
We're releasing the other half of the content later in the season. Dude! Why? So we could be bored? So you can get your fucking player retention up? Like, please, what sense does that make? Infinity Ward? Another thing they did, they made the footsteps louder after we complained in the beta about, oh, turn the footsteps volume down a bit, turn it down, they're too loud. They did that, and what did they do? A month later, they fuck us in the ass and say, yeah, take that, you fucking rushers. And then, dead silence, only lasts for like five seconds the minute you activate it, so you can't flank, you can't rush. Which is ridiculous and stupid. Like, why? Why do you guys cater to fucking noobs every time? And then they didn't fix the UI, which yip de do. So fucking annoyed. And then Warzone, like uh, I knew the minute Warzone came out, nobody, nobody's gonna be playing the multiplayer. This game's multiplayer, the core gameplay, it is phenomenal. Honestly, the gameplay of this game. And surprisingly, the streaks, like the fucking Harrier, the SAE, it would keep me going back to this game. The weapons are fun to use, but unfortunately, now, I don't know. Because since this update, the lobbies, woo, they're much more sweatier. Which, you know, I'm not going to complain. This lobby here was kind of sweaty. And eventually, dude, I can't even con complete. And Fanny Ward, I really, really just hope you can make a comeback for this game. It's not too late. I love this game. This game. It's honestly the most played game I've had in the since Black Ops 4. This game actually feels like a COD to me. Don't ruin this game, Infinity Ward. Don't. Just don't. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. Please subscribe. Um, I know... Oh, I'm complaining. But if you guys enjoyed the video, like, subscribe. And yeah, I'm out. Peace.